Welcome back everyone. Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me again to a um, video of music with Nick. Now this is uh, going to be something a little bit different. This is not a marathon or a request. It, it is in essence a marathon, but it's like one of my um, just like, you know, like have you heard videos you know it's like i would i'm gonna call it like nick's vault because this is literally out of my vault out of my um cd collection um that i discovered throughout the years and and the story of this one is pretty um pretty cool because i stumbled uh across this music literally by accident and when i was um back in the day when i was um online looking for new albums you know in when when you could already download you know off of forums and stuff so i would you know go on these forums and and pretty much i was obsessed with aldi miola and uh you know uh alan holdsworth and and then uh one time i looked up on wikipedia well what what else is are these guys on you know and so i stumbled across um gong this band um and uh there is a, a cool connection here um that uh basically this um singer guitar player david allen um uh he formed soft machine and he's part of this also this band called gong right and so there was a little spin-off band uh from gong um also like bill bruford um just to name you know guys that i know and that you know um were involved in the, specifically this this guy called pierre morlin or, or pierre morlin or like what, what you want to call him but he made like literally an a uh another gong and uh that's basically basically called um pierre morlin's gong and that's the the music I'm gonna show you today. I'm gonna to do four songs. This is a album I I had um on my iPod for years, and it was just I would listen to this very very much, and it just like I don't know, just sprung into my mind today. I was like, this would be a cool thing to show the channel, you know, just something different. Something that maybe not everyone knows, you know. So this is a French drummer and he has played um, with Mike Oldfield. So there's a connection uh, with a band that I know, Magma, um, uh, with the guitarist Gabriel Federo. And even talks about here a little bit about Genesis and stuff. But I'm not going to get too much into that stuff. I just want you to listen to the music. So let's get down, you know, to business and um we're going to start with the with this album that i was um pretty much obsessed with for a long time and even though it's not really the instruments that i play but it was just like i don't know i uh i just like it very much so this is we're talking about the album time is key and as you see on the cover or on the thumbnail you can see the album or i have it right here on my phone um that's the album cover and uh, let me just switch this back because I'm listening on my phone. So let's switch it to the PC. So this is obviously all improvised as always, everything I do here. So, um, okay. So um, it's gonna be about 18 minutes of music. I'm not gonna interrupt it. Um, if, if it somehow gets blocked and I'll just upload it on the Patreon because since you've never heard it, or maybe you have, I mean, I might, it, it just flows in one song flows into the other. So it's kind of like, I don't know. I don't really know what to say, but I just want you guys to enjoy. And I hope this is something new that I can bring something new to the channel. And um, let's go. I'll be ready in just a second. All right. And I'm ready to go. So the first song, <laughs> actually, I was not really ready, but the first song is called Art not grind um uh, and then we have earth rise it's gonna flow into earth rise then supermarket and then um fairy steps or fairy uh steps i think it's fairy but it could be french but i don't know 
yeah, man, I'll put the list in the description you so you can look the album. Uh, you can look up the album. It is on Spotify for my, I mean, I was like so happy when I found it. Um, I had to do a little bit of digging because I didn't really remember the album. So I had to go into my hard drive and then just like search. And then I was like looking for Gong, but only the, the original Gong would come up. And I didn't know that it was called Pierre, you know, uh, Pierre, um, Pierre's Gong. So, but without further ado, here we go. And you guys enjoy. Here we go. Boom.
Okay, I just it was so cool right now because I did remember um this is on a silo phone, I guess. And um and I did play this over and over because this arpeg this this arpeggio section I I transcribed it on to a guitar and I don't remember. I would have to relearn it, but it's really good as you heard. But um yeah. What a trip. It sounds very oriental. Um just beautiful man it's just a trip <laughs> I'm so happy to share this with you guys I know this is not gonna get many views but if you like it share it you know just like share it you know and um, because not people not a lot of people are gonna click on this video we will know we know okay let's keep going that's a fun <laughs>
there you go. Um, first half of the uh, of the CD time is key. Actually, it's only the fourth song. There's eleven songs on here, and I just recommended. Um, th but this is the four songs that are connected, which is basically one song, like uh, almost like an like a prelude, and then you know the overture. But it doesn't. It does have different names. But um, man, what good memories! This is this was amazing. Um, I know it's not for everyone, you know. Maybe it's boring for me. I hear all the arpeggios, you know, and all the um, the chords and the arpeggios being played over the chords, and it's very, very, very interesting. Uh, from a just a musical perspective, like when you analyze the music, it's very rich. Um, uh. But I don't know, you know, it's uh, it's an acquired taste, you know. I, I stumbled across it literally by accident, and when I first put it on, I was, like, mesmerized, you know. Um, that's literally one of the only... I'm, I'm off the few, you know, Led Zeppelin and, you, you know, and this from 1979. That's a 70s album that I heard religiously. Um, and also, of course, like, Soft Machine and stuff like that, that so funny that Soft Machine <laughs> is literally the inception of this channel because uh, I uploaded a Soft Machine video and as you know, we got a strike and they were going to take down the channel. And then Alexa said, hey, why don't you just play me the music and I react to it? And I was like, that's a horrible idea, you know. So this is how this whole thing got into motion, this reaction channel. But yeah, so this, I guess this band has a little bit to do with it. Um, because of Gong and, and Soft Machine and King Crimson, you know, and uh, people involved, people that are involved here are involved in these other bands that we now listen to. Um, so, so crazy. So I do, I, I do hope you enjoyed, uh, you know, I mean, if you're still here, then, you know, kudos, man, because it's really good, you know, I mean, it, like I said, you know, it's not for everyone, but I love it. The the Pedro sections are <laughs> insane. Um and it's not too out there, you know. I mean it's it's just like maybe you don't like the uh the instrument being used, but the drumming is off the charts, you know. So yeah, I hope you did enjoy. Thank you so much for watching, you know, and uh I hope um I hope you, you share this, you know, and uh, I hope you like it, maybe you buy it, and um it is available on Spotify if you wanna hear the whole thing but if you want to own it i think it's a great album all right thank you guys for watching see you in the next one <laughs>